Ah, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 3, that sweet spot where the series was more about this than this. Or God help us this. If you're just beginning, you can get on it and just do the sort of turning motions and the game will sort of guide. Yeah, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 3 was pretty great, which is why I was slightly disappointed to see none of the iconic maps from the game make it into the XBLA Birdman reboot Tony Hawk's Pro Skater HD. However, that's now changed thanks to the release of the Tony Hawk Pro Skater HD Revert Pack. The revert in the title refers to the revert move, something that was missing from Pro Skater HD's original release and which has now been added to the game via a free title update, something that makes a huge difference to the game. No, honestly it does. They'll probably be back online later. Put simply, reverts allow you to chain together enormous combos. By hitting right or left trigger as you land in a halfpipe and then going into a manual, you can string together air combos for as long as you can keep your balance, opening the door for massive combo scores way beyond anything that was previously possible. Originally, the revert ability was only going to be usable on the new maps, but it actually works on all the original levels from Tony Hawk's Pro Skater HD as well, so go nuts. Now onto those new levels I was talking about taken from Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 3. First up is Canada, set in Calgary, Alberta, which features frozen rivers to skate on, snowmen to smash, and snowballs to collect as well as plenty of rails and tree branches to grind. Next is Airport, based in Fukuoka, Japan. This is a great level for super long grind lines as you can switch between rails on the moving walkways, seating areas and escalators. Sadly you don't get a gap for endlessly grinding the baggage claim anymore which invalidates my old high score method immediately. Thanks Tony. Finally there's Hollywood set in downtown LA which is more of a street level featuring tons of steps, ledges, rails and low walls for long grinds. There's still half and quarter pipes dotted around if you prefer vert skating though, and the level's standout feature, the earthquake, is still included. Grind four specific rails throughout the level and you cause an earthquake that reconfigures parts of the terrain, and probably causes untold destruction and misery, but hey, look at these sick new lines bro, totally worth it. The Tony Hawk Revert Pack is available now for 400 MSP, but if you think that's too steep for three new levels, remember that the revert ability is free, so grab that and get smashing your old high scores. See you on the leaderboards! Don't beat my scores though, I'll be upset.